Hey, how are you doing tonight? I think you heard me. I'm nervous. <laughs> Don't be. You look gorgeous. I was literally complimenting your dress as soon as you walked in. I was like, she's giving. Ponytail, yeah. everything. Yes, ma'am. The Ariana Grande. Yes, ma'am. Get into it. So, as you know, obviously, we are here to celebrate the premiere of Fear. How do you feel about it? Like, literally, we were wearing a pandemic. Now we're here in person. I know. That, this is the first event that I... I'm sorry that I keep looking at you. <laughs> this is the first event that I've been to since COVID. So, so that's a nervous thing but being on the set was also nerve-wracking because it was going on during the pandemic so it's just a blessing and I'm so happy to be here and I can't wait for everybody to arrive I'm super excited. now this film tell me is it based off of people unlocking their different fears that are taking place and did you develop any new fears while filming I did develop new fears while filming this and it's because when you work with people that love what they do it really makes an impact and they're one of the women haunted me for months like and one of the days that I went back to my hotel room I shut the light off and I saw her in the corner and I was like oh my gosh it's all in my imagination mind you but she's that good in the film that and and as for the film it's um, a group of people coming together for a getaway weekend and it's encouragement to turn around and face your fears because we all have fears right and what's important is to turn around and figure out how can I help you how can I fix you so that we can move on from these fears so tell me about your character that you play I play Serena who is a very strong very very good friend to Annie. They've known each other their whole lives, and she just wants to be a part of the fun weekend with a group of friends, and little does she know. <laughs> Chaos. Chaos ensues. Definitely. Now, I know you also have a background in playing a Happy Death Day and Happy Death Day to You, which I love, both of those films. How does this film differ from playing in that horror film? I feel like in Happy Death Day, there were moments of relief, and there were moments of comedy that kind of calmed you down. This is pure terror. This is pure just constant looking over your shoulder, which Batch did make us do on set quite often. Freaking Batch. <laughs> I'm going to start using that. Yeah, please. <laughs> There's an interview. You see me. I'm like, I'm sorry. Batch is somewhere on set. <laughs> that is so cool. So it sounds like you guys had a great time on set, which I love. Yeah. Um, the people that are involved in this film, be it Hidden Empire Film Group, Roxanne, Dion, the whole cast, profound human beings. And I don't use that word lightly. Like, as human beings, as artists, all around, it was so much fun. And I'm going to quote T.I., we are bonded for life from this experience. <laughs> well, thank you so much for stopping by, Ms. Ruby. Thank you.